How you doing, my deplorable brothers and sisters? Uh, this is Latino's perspective. I haven't done a video since Donald Trump won the election. It doesn't it feel good to say uh, president-elect Donald Trump? Yeah, it does feel good. Man, I've been, I've been feeling good ever since he won just because Hillary Clinton is not is not in there but not only that uh Donald Trump man he did a, he risked his life and is still risking his life cuz believe me they they probably want to kill him you know I'll be honest with you they probably want to kill him but I was at the gym I just got back from the gym LA Fitness and I was I was running and I was watching uh Sh Sean Hannity reading reading what they had to say Laura Ingram was on there they were talking about the uh the Russian hacking, and uh, and I just want to say this. This is why I want, want to make this video. For those of you that are that are, for those of you stupid idiots that are still watching the mainstream media, uh, other than than Fox, because Fox at least they're 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 not they didn't go that far left yet. And if it wasn't for Sean Hannity. I, uh, I, I think they'd be Sean Hannity and, and uh, uh, there, there's a couple other people on there that 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 uh, that are on the right. But as far as if you're st if you're one of the idiots that are still watching CNN, MSNBC, ABC, NBC, CBS, reading the, the Washington Post. Uh, reading the New York Times and you're believing that fake garbage now that's fake news they're talking about fake news no they're scared they know that that the other news alternative news which be which comes from people like me and you and where we get our news sources is from each other and you know there's people out there that do a lot of research that's because the truth is out there and they know the truth but they just don't report the truth. And all they do is report lies. And if you're still watching that, you're, you're a lame brain. You're, you're, a, you're a dummy because they're dumbing you down. You're dumbing, they're, they're dumbing you down because you don't want to take the time to do research. Because you, you don't want the truth. Because maybe like Jack Nicholson said, you can't handle the truth. You know, I don't even care if I don't know, if, if, if I know you. You know, you may be my relative, my friend, someone I went to school with, someone I worked with, and we got along, everything, because I get along with everybody. Because, you know, I don't know what your political views are. I don't go asking. You know, I barely got into this uh, 18 months ago. You know, I voted before because I'm, I'm I, you know, I don't want to vote for uh, Democratic views, man, because they're leftist views. They're not good for us. They're good for the politicians. That's it. You know, they like like Donald Trump said, you know, all talk, no action. You promise the world you get in there and you don't do nothing but fill line up your own pockets. You know, so you're you're. You're like my dad used to say, you're stupid, stupid, stupid if you are still watching, especially CNN, man. Anderson Cooper. Oh, man, I'm seeing these these videos, man. Anderson Cooper, that stupid idiot, Don Lemon and all these stupid people that they have on there. I mean, quit it. Stop it. Do yourself a favor. And go do your own research instead of believing these lies. Here's the story. Russian, the Russian hacking. You know, first of all, if, if they did do it, they, it, it's all true. It's all true. Hillary Clinton, they're still, you don't even know the half of it. I, I'm, I'm just, this is the surface. But what Hillary Clinton and all those people are into, it will make your stomach turn, man like the pizza gate thing and and fox news none of the news is reporting that and it's sickening man what they're do what they what they're doing man that john podesta and his brother 
And uh, even what the heck's his name, man? That rapper that's married to Beyonce. I forgot. I don't even know his name, man. He's an idiot, man. But you don't even know what they're into, man. Child pornography, man. Molestation of babies. Offering up to Molech. You know, it, evil, evil stuff. You know, four months ago, they're saying, they're saying, oh, the Russian uh, manipulated the the outcome of the of, of of the election. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Just because Hillary Clinton didn't win, now you're saying, now they're saying that. But four months ago, three three four months ago, Barack Obama, go look at go look at some videos. There's plenty of them out there. He said that it was ridiculous that that oh that's so ridiculous that somebody can manipulate the American elections. That's so don't even pay attention. That's that's preposterous. That that's not going to that doesn't happen. That's ridiculous of Donald Trump to say that cuz Donald Trump was saying the elections are rigged. And then Hillary Clinton in the last debate, I believe, she what did she say? She said uh that I should the next day after the debate, uh, she, she had a, a, a rally and she told him, I cannot believe this man, Donald Trump, would 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 uh, uh, put our democracy in jeopardy by saying that these elections are rigged. You know why? Because they thought they were going to win. And now all of a sudden uh, the elections were rigged because Russia had a big part to do with uh, uh, reporting against uh, uh, Hillary Clinton. No, no, no. How about this? How about the all the mainstream media reporting wrong information of Donald Trump? No one's saying anything about that. How about CNN not being fair and literally on the side of Hillary Clinton making sure that she's going to get elected reported nothing but garbage on Donald Trump. Everything he tried to do, good things, they always spend it. They never reported anything bad about Hillary Clinton unless someone they brought on there and they brought up the subject. You know what? If you're watching this news, you're stupid, stupid, stupid. Stop it. Stop watching that. Stop believing it. It's not true. It, I mean, it's ridiculous. And for you to even, if, if you're, I know that you're not stupid. I mean, you're uh, more, uh, less than half the American people are the 40%, 30%, 35% that voted for Hillary. You're not that stupid. Please, open up your eye. You're just stubborn. You just don't want to know the truth. Okay? But the bottom line is, is, you know, hey, anything can happen. I've been telling you, Jesus is about to come back. So whether Donald Trump, if 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 he if they do take it from him, these these electors are getting threatened. Okay, so we don't know what's going to happen. They are doing everything they can to keep the, keep Donald Trump from taking taking and sitting in the Oval Office. Everything. So if he gets, if he does not get in there. You bet Jesus is coming. If he does get in there and he does uh, bring back jobs, uh, creates jobs, everything's flowing good. He keeps, you know, maybe 20% uh, of his promises. That's better than we're at right now. He builds the wall. All I care about building the wall, build our military and, 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 our, and our border and not letting not letting uh, uh, people from the Middle East in no more. We can't afford it. We don't have the money. Stop it already. If it's not in our best interest, it ain't going to happen. If we got to bring in people and support them, then, then it's not going to happen. No, stop it. I don't, I don't believe in that stuff. But the Bible says, and then let's say he brings peace to the Middle East, all that. Well, the Bible says peace, peace, then comes sudden destruction. So either way, Jesus is coming. So if you're if you don't believe in God, you better get on your knees and you better you better uh, try hard and say, I don't believe in you, God. I need your help. Help my mind. And so that I can believe in you and I can make it to heaven because there is a heaven and a hell. OK, 
So that's all I wanted to say. If you like it, uh, share it, comment, and subscribe. Uh, this is uh, Latino Perspective. God bless you. And uh, hey, Donald Trump made it. He won. Hillary Clinton's out. Thank you, Jesus. Bye.